So far, we have learnt about materialized views and we have learnt how to refresh the materialized view on commit or on demand. Now, let's see another option where we schedule the refresh. That means automatically based on our schedule, the materialized view refresh by itself. Okay? To support this functionality, there is a start with clause in materialized view creation. Okay, the option is start with sysdate. That means start with today. That means right now. Refresh the materialized view right now and then next sysdate plus 7. That means after 7 days, refresh it again. That means for every 7 days, the materialized view will be refreshed. Okay, and another example. If I want to refresh my materialized view for every 30 minutes, all I have to say is next system date plus 30 divided by 24 into 60. Here the interval is 30 minutes. For every 30 minutes the refresh will happen. If you want to refresh for every 60 minutes it is 60 divided by 24 into 60. Okay, like this depending upon the necessity you can define your start with option so that the refresh will happen automatically. Okay, so now let's go and create a materialized view with the start with option. Okay, so I want a materialized view sales underscore mv1. Okay, I want the refresh type to be fast. That's fine. On demand if I need it. But I want this to be refreshed every minute. Okay, just to give a demo. If I give 30 minutes, we have to wait really 30 minutes for me to show you the demo. Right, so I will refresh every minute. Okay, so it is start with this date means refresh it right now and then the next interval is next this date plus so for every minute so 1 divided by 24 into 60. Okay, that's all. So let me create this. So sales underscore mv1 created. Okay, so now Let's see how many rows we have in the table. We have 91. Okay. So in the materialized view, let me see how many we have. MV1. And uh, so 91. Okay. So now let me insert the data. Okay. So for 16th January and order ID 3. Okay. And let me insert the data. And let me do the commit. Okay. Right now the time is 10.34. Okay. 10.34 AM. Now let me wait one minute so that the data is refreshed in the sales underscore MV1. Okay. So now the time is 10.35. Okay. So let me run this select statement and let me see if we have 92 rows. Yes, we have 92 rows. You see the 16th January sales date row is inserted with the 1563 order ID. Cool, right? Like this, the materialized view will be refreshed for every minute. Okay.